get used to uh, letting the ball roll off their fingers and not using so much of their body. So what I'll do is I'll actually hold their arm here and she's going to try to throw the ball from there. Good. And so I'm holding her arm still so it's not moving and her shoulders aren't moving. Go ahead. And what it should look like if she's doing this right is her fingertips should come up. So one more time. Okay. So the, what we want to look for in this is that the ball goes straight to the target and it doesn't have this little loopy thing like this. So we don't want the ball to come up like that. We want to make sure she's releasing it early enough to go straight to the target and stay low. Okay, so you have your grip. Make sure they have the right grip every time. Go ahead. Good. And the one thing I see with this drill is that the girls will try to use their body, but I'm trying to hold them still. So you want to keep on telling them, try to relax their, their arm, try to relax their shoulders, and just feel the ball in their fingertips right now. One more. Good. Okay. So from here, since I'm not going to be there when they're practicing every time, I'm going to have them use their glove, and they're going to get their grip. They're going to use their glove to hold their arm here. Okay. And make sure, this is one thing you want to make sure, they tend, as they do this throughout time, they start practicing more and more, they start to come out here a little. And we've got to make sure that they're still back here. They keep it right by their side. Okay, go ahead. And the catcher knows if she's using too much of her body, that ball's coming in too fast. She should barely be able to make it there if she's doing this right.